Hey there, Tony Policastro here with the Acoustic Letter brought to you by Music Villa. Today, we're gonna hear the difference between ladder bracing and X bracing on these two very fine Waterloo guitars. But before we do so, I wanna make sure you stick around to the end of this comparison and sign up for the Acoustic Letter. Just for doing so, I'm gonna send you my Acoustic Guitar Buyer's Guide along with some other goodies. <laughs> If you find yourself answering yes to the question, am I an acoustic guitar geek, this comparison is right up your alley. We finally get to hear the difference between X bracing and ladder bracing on essentially the same guitar. Now I know guitars are made of wood and they're all different and they all have their own character, but this is a darn close comparison on two almost identical instruments with different bracing. What we have in my left hand is the Waterloo WL14XTR. What we have in my right hand is the Waterloo WL14LTR. You'll notice that the names only have one letter different. Now, this guitar in my left hand has X bracing, so think sunburst, X bracing. The guitar in my right hand has ladder bracing, so think black guitar, ladder brace. Everything else on these guitars is identical. Solid Sitka spruce top, solid mahogany back and sides, V-neck, adjustable truss rod on both, ebony bridge, ebony bridge pins, long cut through saddle, rosewood fingerboard with dot inlay, inch and three quarter ebony nut, stenciled Waterloo logo, three on a strip tuners. I mean, we're talking these guitars are nearly the same, but the bracing is indeed different. Remember, sunburst, X bracing, black guitar, ladder braced. Now, before we play these two guitars, I have one last thing. X bracing and ladder bracing are very, very different in sound. It's because of their physical properties. X bracing basically puts an X along the top of the guitar, leaving the lower bout completely open. Ladder bracing places the cross braces directly across the lower bout. So it kind of, in a way, constricts it, but in the best way. So there's a pronounced difference between these two, and I don't want to skew you, but you might expect a little bit more bark and a little bit more directness and note separation from the ladder brace guitar and a little bit more sustain and smoothness in the mid-range from the X brace guitar. So I'm going to let you be the judge of which one you like the most. Now it's finally time to play them. Don't forget to sign up for the Acoustic Letter today. It's the quickest way to get pricing and photos on all of these instruments, and it will ensure that you never miss a review. Just for signing up today, I'm going to send you my Acoustic Guitar Buyer's Guide and five-day practice plan all for free.
To join, go ahead and click the link or go to AcousticLetter.com forward slash join. Now, if you're interested in purchasing either of these guitars, head on over to AcousticLetter.com where you can see these along with hundreds of other guitar reviews that I've done. Thanks a lot for checking it out.